Well, you're still watching your Sunday show, the O and M Sunday show. I'm Obiora Ilo, and um, joining us now is Nollywood actress Annabelle Choma Mbono. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you very much. Please, oh my God! Please sit down. Yeah, I've been. I've been watching uh, the promo of your new work. All right. It's called, um, oh my God, the, the latest work. The Gaddafi. Gaddafi, <laughs> yes. I've been watching the promo yeah. of Gaddafi. What is it all about? There's uh, so much hype about the film. That's true. I'm very sure you know about um, the, you know all about the story of the Gaddafi sometime. The Ray Gaddafi? Yeah, the Ray Gaddafi. So it's just something uh, um, to tell about the ancient things that happened back in the days. You know, we need to do something different from what uh, 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 we have been doing ordinarily in the industry. So, and um, the, the movie is going to be in, in, in the market any moment from now. And trust me, you don't want to miss out on it. It's, it has a lot of stories in it. it, it it's, 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 it was just uh, a group of girls being taunted by by their boss who, who, who is who, let me just say an instrument of the devil you know he, he we, we were, were tarished we were, we were hard girls in the movie so okay um, job, so. well that's i don't know the, what number that movie is in your lineup of course i remember the hit i remember yeah. chica the native girl the native girl i remember you can and, and all that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What, you know, what inspired you? What made you go into this business? You know, something that has been in you can't, it, it really can't go out of you no matter how long it takes. You know, acting has really been a part of me ever since I was a baby. You know, like my father always says, you know, that I'm too dramatic in everything I do and all that. So, and I think I, 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 I never gave up even when I was in, in, in high school you know, back in the days in cactism and all that, I was always really good in, you know, that's, that has really been my passion, you know, talking and, you know, expressing myself in, in, in any form you could just act. Is, it, is it. it because you want to reach the people? Is it, what, what, what is the underlying objective for you in acting? The message, given the message, you, the acting for me is, Given the message, you, you, whatever you ask in, in any movie tells exactly somehow who you are. Do you understand me? So, and um, I think it's something I really want to reach out to, uh, um, to, to the world. But does that, does that affect the choice of movies you're going to? I mean, are there um, some kinds of movies because of the kind of message they're, 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 you know, they are sending out there? Absolutely. And you will turn it down? Not exactly. It's a matter of choice anyway. And um, most of the times, but I think as a professional, you don't have to turn down any script that really comes to you, especially the fact that if it's something really it, it has to tell with what you desire, that thing, that message you want to send out to the world now, you know. So but if it's something that is not uh, sending the message you want to send, I mean, would you turn it down, that's even why with all the money? That's what it's called acting. But, but, but that does not mean you should subdue to whatever role that comes to you. You have the choice to say, no, I don't want to do this. I or want I want to do this. this. Yeah, so that's it. Okay. Um, you know, actresses and actors are like role models. And a lot of us parents, you know, are getting worried about the things we see. Uh, oh. People in your industry <laughs> push out our children at home. Let me give you an instance. I was on the internet and I saw a Nigerian actress, pregnant and nude. Pregnant and nude? Yes. It's, it's trending. A Nigerian actress? A Nigerian actress. Well, I... And I'm like, what message is this young woman sending out? Was she, was she literally on set acting or...? No, no, no. She, she, she just... Was, yeah. And she was... Really? She was nude, as in nude. Well, uh, well, you know, we're going to show that, but because of uh, NBC rules, okay. we're, we're not showing it. I mean, okay, does, it, I does it worry you that, you know, as role models, people in your industry can mislead a lot of young people by what they do or what they don't do? Um, well, I think um, nudity is a matter of choice. And um, 
I don't I ha I don't know what to say about the actress you said you saw who actually f uh, was flaunting her maybe the baby bombs whatever I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I I can't explain it. But if you're actually talking about maybe you're on set and you have to just go nude, it's it's your choice because the the, the, the script says you need to act what the script is talking about. That does not make you a, a porn star or whatever but then you you also have the choice to say that i i want to deliver this role perfectly because i'm a professional and all that but that of taking shirts and um, posting on internet and all that well i don't know i it's a matter of choice like i said so that's it and we're also worried about the stories we hear about lesbianism and gay stuff in nollywood is this something that is true well les you're talking about gay being gay, yeah. Oh, well, um, what I would say is, coming from the background where you hail from, I think you should be a headline to wherever you're heading to. I, 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 in life, generally, I just believe in one thing. This is something you were not brought up into, so you shouldn't even go. So I'm, I'm totally against it. So I wouldn't know... Uh, um, um, uh, what whatever the uh, whoever is uh, who indulges in it, whatever they the the they achieve tend to achieve. I don't know, but coming from a Christian background, that we are, we are all Christians, most of us in the industry, and I don't think uh, um, um, literally anybody from a good Christian home should go into practicing that. And okay. That. Do you so do you feel fulfilled in this business? Oh, what's the word to use? Like any word be your bigger bigger than fulfilled. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I just I just see I just see I, I just see my dreams coming true gradually. Is it because of the money? Not the money. How much is the there? The fame. How much is there? What's the fame? We're talking about <laughs> doing what you want to do. This is something you have this happiness when you're doing and all that, you know? So it's not really about the money or the fame most of the time. You're so having you know. fun. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. Okay. <laughs> well, um Annabelle. It's been my pleasure. Thank you very much. I'm sure you oblige us again when we do invite you. Why not? Please, would you kindly keep this okay. somewhere dear, <laughs> in a dear corner in your home? I think I'm going to be using this every morning. Take my tea and all that, but thank you. Going to me thank you. Thank you very <laughs> much. <laughs> and that's your show for today. The O and M Sunday show. I'm Obiora Ilo from Abuja, Nigeria. Let's do it again on Friday night. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel at Urban TV Nigeria, Facebook Urban TV Nigeria, and Instagram Urban TV underscore Nigeria. Many thanks for watching.